What's up, Home Slice? Lucas here. So it's about that time again. Time for a stunt review 2019. Looking back at the flips, tricks, power moves, stunts that I've learned throughout the year. My progression. But you gotta focus. Nothing gives you confidence more like starting the new year off with a weigh in. Jeez. Here we are in the gym, heavy as heck, right after the holidays, working on my breakdance skills, my power moves, working on my b-boy stuff. Yo, so a huge theme for 2019 for me was combining flips with power moves. And I started the year off hot, started the year off fresh. Now, I just want to say my average weight for the entire year, just out of my guesstimation, was probably around 192. So weighing in at 196, I was pretty heavy right there. Um... So yeah, I decided, hey, it's cold outside, it's freezing out there, I'm going to combine some flips with power moves inside to help maintain my flips and also work on my power. So that's exactly what we did, man. And we started off a little choppy, obviously, but you will see in a minute how we progress. So it's not looking bad, not looking bad at all. But yeah, you can see how frigid cold it was. There was like no training outside at all. I mean, for crying out loud, water turned to ice when I threw it in there. Jeez. Um, so yeah, just a couple weeks after uh, coming back from no training for two weeks during the holidays, you know, already getting it back, full swing. All that's pretty much new right there. I'm trying to add some freezes into my power moves. I'm trying to come up with these creative transitions like you know but um often failed to freeze at the end i guess i need well i guess i know what i need to work on now in 2020 i had the freeze it's something i needed to work on from day one. Oh, shut down all right enough of that for now let's move outside to the first flipping session of the year now something i want to highlight here from uh the first flipping session in 2019 is that it's been about like three months here since I've tricked outside but it seems like most of my power is still there if not even more and I want to attribute that to training that high intensity inside of the gym um, working on those b-boy and power moves training at a high intensity and I think that helped me have more power when it came to coming back outside like I was afraid I wasn't gonna be able to flip at all like I would have to relearn everything but just training inside help me maintain if not improve some aspects of my flips even though you know I was limited to what I could do so yeah back here inside more power moves more flips you can see what I'm working on man it's all pretty much new stuff shut down then we came back outside here so we're starting to get warmed up for the year right that's what's going on here we're starting to get warmed up right we're like you know we're just getting into it this is like March-ish, April-ish, you know, sun's out. It's time to time to get those flips back. Where you, you know those, oh, there it is, yeah. I was so happy about that. And then another big one this year was the uh, B-Twist of Cork. I landed that before, but... Um, like, I, I only landed it like once or twice. But I landed it like eight times this year. Eight times, dude, whoa! Look at notice the ducks in there. Oh, back on the trampoline. So my trampoline progression for 2019, how was that? Pretty terrible. I'm just gonna be honest. Literally nothing new on the trampoline. Um, yeah, working on double backs. What? I thought you already landed that in 2018. Yeah, I did. I landed it quite a few times in 2018, but then I got scared, and I had to relearn it in 2019, and then I pretty much quit. <laughs> Bro, bro, why'd you quit? Why'd you get so scared? Man, okay, I'll tell you why. Because I got overzealous one day, all right? Check this out. This is what happened. So I was like, yo, I can already do a double. You know, why even waste time with a triple? Let's just go for an octuplet. And then this happened. Do you know how bad that hurt? Okay, I'm just obviously kidding. But yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> sorry, okay. Anyways, back outside here. All right, time for some new stuff, guys. Getting sassy here. Some new tricks. I was like, yo, let's get a little creative with the, with some mind-bending stuff, some mind-boggling stuff in 2019. 
So the Peter Pan B twist. Um, if you guys didn't see the video, yeah, basically that's just where you put your hands on your hips while doing a B twist. It's difficult because you want to use your hands in a B twist to you know help with the momentum. So not using the hands, kind of weird, but I did it, kinda. Boom. So I was happy about that. A lot of my lands and a lot of my accomplishments in 2019 regarding stunts were like creative mindish, mind-boggling stuff to me. Stuff to me that was like uh, difficult, scary, and like I just couldn't do. This one, for example, here's the next one on the list. Yo, the cart side flip. There it is. Yeah, you see that smile because that's the first time I ever landed that flip. What? How could you not have had this before? It's just, it was such a weird setup. I don't know. But, you know, I'm like, hey, you know what? Moves I haven't gotten be got before, but that should be easy. I'm going to try. And that's what I did this year. And cart side flip. Boom. Yo. Okay. Here's probably like the craziest happy I've ever been 2019 right here was finally getting this move. Another mind boggler for me was the touchdown raise swing through cork. Something I tried early on in my tricking days when I first started and never ever landed. But finally this year, like I said, I was gonna attack it and get it. Oh man, we got close. We got frustrated, we got covered with grass. Dead grass everywhere, yeah, I don't, what? But, um, oh man. And then right there when I hit that, I was like, you know what, I know I got this. You can tell right there, you just gotta focus, yeah. And there it is, the first touchdown raise swing through cork I've ever landed. I was so stoked, man. So stoked. I think honestly that was the most exciting combo I landed the entire year. I don't think I was like that excited for any other combo the entire year. You can tell because I'm getting cringy. All right, and then after that, I'm like, yo, okay, so we need, to, we need to land something new here. Let's make something up. So I don't know what the heck that was, but um, okay, yeah, so we didn't really get it there. So I'm like, hey, I'm going to get this uh, at home. Um, trying some, like, thing. I don't know what it's called. I'm trying to, like, plant on the wall with all my limbs and then jump off the wall into a backflip. And, um. I think I got it there. So yeah, like a mind bender, mind boggler to me. I'm not saying to you. There's guys out there, you know, shaping shapes. You know what I mean? But me, I'm just uh this to me was weird. Yeah. Man, it was kinda lame. <laughs> Honestly. <clears throat> okay, another mind boggler for me. The cork off the wall, yo. So first we landed on the trampoline as like, you know, a prerequisite. I'm like, yo, okay, I got this. This was another big accomplishment for me because I never, ever landed it. Even I never even attempted this before. And I was like, all in one day, I'm like, yo, I'm going to get this. Oh, man, you missed your pad. Jeez. So, this one's just weird, but we got it. So, I was stoked. Cork off the wall. Oh, man, that was sketchy. I was happy about that one too, not gonna lie. Yeah, that one was really sketchy. Hope you guys aren't minding this commentary, me talking, talking over myself here. If I'm annoying you, just mute, mute me. All right, so we're back inside here with some more, more specialty stuff that I learned new this year. Um, oh, shuffling, there's something, something I learned this year that I was like, hey, Actually, no, I started that in uh, 2018, but I got way better this year, in my opinion. So, man, I want to show you guys some specialty stuff in a second here. All right, but first, another thing. Oh, like I said, B-twist, swing through, cork. Landed that, you know, quite a few times this year by quite a few, about 10-ish times, which is quite a few for me. Here it is. Oh, there's a land right there. Yeah, you see that? Oh, man. All right, here's something special that I uh, felt pretty pretty accomplished about. This is more like, oh yeah. So I'm trying to catch 
off the back handspring trying to catch into a handstand, which is really kind of hard, well, for me at least, because it's like your momentum wants to keep going backwards. And it's kind of sketchy. But this was something totally new for me this year that basically got... Oh, yeah, right there. That one... Yeah, that was cool. Maybe we're going to take some more swings at that and try to clean that up. Um, definitely something super new right there in 2019. Getting technical, all right? Hey, if we're going to want to, you know, compete in the 2024 Olympics for b-boying, we got we to gotta train hard, right? So trying to add to it. And then, hey, maybe, maybe this year we could try to clean this up right here. Oh, dang, yeah. Yo, that was actually pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's happy about that. He isn't me. Oh, man, if I could have continued that. Oh, wait, we're going to go for it again right here. Oh, man, so close. And if I could have continued that into air flares, that would have been uh, world class. Well, maybe world class 2010, but hey, that's Oh, here's another one. I don't recommend doing this, but, you know, since this is a stunt reel, this stunt was crazy, guys, and I never recommend doing this because you're about to see what happens. If you try to walk across a power line, oh, man. Oh, glitch in the matrix. What the heck? All right, anyways, um, sorry about that again. Back here, relearning this move right here, palm spin. Or a palm flip, whatever. Man, I think I messed up the name on this. Um, yeah. Took me a little bit to relearn that, but we got that back. Actually, I shouldn't even have included that because that's from like last year. All right, another mind boggler right here. This is the um, miss leg full. So cart miss leg full. I'm going off the leg that's I'm not supposed to be going off of. You know, for a full. You know. The one on the outside and um honestly this move was just so mind-boggling for me because it's like don't don't go just stop don't go you're gonna fall on your face and i had to get over it by going in this ditch here where the grass was softer where those ducks were that's where the ducks were earlier in the video if you guys remember seeing the ducks in the background it used to be filled with water and that's why it's so soft so i acted like i landed that right there but i didn't there we go that one i'd count more not that one you just saw so we finally got it there after so many tries. I don't think I've, I tried that flip so many t tries because it was just so mind boggling. And then I'm also working on more touchdown rays this year. Um, and yeah, tried to clean that up. All right, this one right here, this one scared the crap out of me. I'm trying to double punch off the wall with both feet, just like that. That was scary on the trampoline for me and, and then I was gonna try to do it on the ground. And um, yeah, I just had to keep going back to the trampoline and the ground back, back, back because like, I, look at how I was just too scared, man. I'm like, yo, that's going to happen on the ground, but my head's going to go straight in that grass and get stuck. My head's going to get stuck in that grass. Yeah, I should make an after effects mess up. Yeah. But then uh, we just started with like a hack flip off the wall like that. And I think that's what helped me break through, man. Hack flip all day. Oh, and then we almost got it right there, but I think I double tapped on the wall, so I didn't really count that. Let's see, one, two. I wanted to kind of have more of a. There we go. There it is. Man, that was low. Oh, man, that was low. I guess I double tapped a little too, but who cares? Whatever. Looked cool. Counts. All right. Back here. So this is like getting now closer to right now. This is me going for those three gainer switches. A goal of mine that I've been talking about for years. You guys hear me talking about it. Three gainer switches, a lifelong dream. Man, we were so close once again this year. Look at this, watch, one, two. No, you should have just sent it, man. You should have sent it. I still lose sleep over that. Oh, man. If I would have just leaned back, bro. 2020 baby 2020 baby all right and then um some more power move stuff uh elbow spins off of air flares slightly new kind of worked on this here and there over the years but um yeah Man. nothing new happened in 2019 
are you kidding me? So much new happened in 2019. And then back here at the hill, trying to go for those three gainer switches again. Couldn't do it. Got two though. Two. Looking good. Looking good with two. Someone once told me I'd never get two. And now you guys are telling me I'll never get four. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I don't know. Probably not, right? Jeez. Don't doubt yourself. You just gotta believe. But you gotta focus. Alright guys, so that pretty much wraps it up right there. That was the year 2019. Those are my stunt accomplishments. The stuff I wanted to share with you guys. I hope you guys had a great year. I can't wait to see you guys in 2020. I'm excited to see what we learned. What we accomplished. Who knows? Hope you guys all have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace. You all have a good one. And I'll see you all in the next video.